Good day everyone. For this tutorial session, we are going to talk about logistic distribution and Pareto distribution. So, logistic distribution The logistic distribution is given in cumulative distribution and this distribution has been used to model tolerance levels and biosic problems. So here we come with our logistic distribution. So we have the function of x with the parameter of alpha and beta is equals to 1 over 1 plus e to the negative times the quantity of x minus alpha over beta. Remember that negative infinity is less than alpha and less than infinity. And our beta here is greater than zero. So for our variance in logistic distribution, we came up to this form. So our variance is equal to beta squared times pi squared over 3. So take note that function of alpha minus t with the parameter of alpha and beta is equal to 1 minus function of alpha plus t with the parameter of alpha and beta. So here, here we come with our Pareto distribution. The Pareto distribution is given in density function and this distribution has found application in modeling problem involving distribution of incomes when income exceed a certain limit of x sub 0. So here we come with our Pareto distribution. So f sub x, the quantity of x with the parameter of x of 0 and theta is equal to theta over x of 0 times x of 0 over x to the theta plus 1 with the indicator of x of 0 to infinity of x. So our theta here is 1, is greater than 0, and our x sub 0 is greater than 0. So next, so for our mean and variance respectively of the Pareto distribution are given by this form. So this is our mean and this is our variance. So our mean is equal to theta times x sub 0 over theta minus 1. For our theta is greater than 1 and for our variance, variance is equal to theta times x sub 0 squared over theta minus 2 minus the quantity of theta times x sub 0 squared over theta minus 1 squared and our theta is greater than 2. So this is 